Tata called Ray Ray and No, director of Akirunga and Soul. It is our clothing label. 5, 6 and 7 XL, kākahu made for comfort, so if you're 5, 6 or 7 XL, like, share, tag, comment and join our event, it's about to come up on the 4th of December, the event should be in the post above, in our comments and all that, um, so follow, like, share, tag, join our event, um, however this is a recap on Sunday when we got to uh, hear a kōrero from Jace Mayer, a beautiful wahine from Turtle Island, um, gave us a kōrero on Indigenous entre Entrepreneurs, uh, she solidified for us that our identity is connected to place and that we are of the land very similar to us in Māori. She gave an example of, of everything that we do it has a ripple effect and as an indigenous is our consequences are beyond ourselves um, and they we are always thinking of our future so this is going to affect like anything that I do now is going to affect the next seven generations um, but because I've got my nana my nana that I live with is my great grandmother so that's, that's four generations above me so that's seven, eight, nine, ten. It's going to affect eleven generations, really. That's a lot of pressure to be awesome. No, um, yeah, just a lot of pressure. Our definition of wealth is not money. It's time. It's time to have with our whanau. And if that means less time having to worry about money, I guess wealth and success run together. And success for me, and it's written all over our page and all over our my Facebook. Um, to be successful I must to support someone else if I can help someone else be successful then that's success to me so whether that's hiring somebody whether that's you know um, like our Thai Alfano creating scholarships you know that that's success you know even getting into wholesales if I could get into wholesales and create opportunities for others to to create business that's success that is the dream you know we, we can support others so now the hope the hope is to go international. I don't want to stay in New Zealand. I want my clothing brand to go international. I want it to go to Samoa. I want it to go to Tonga. I want it to go to Canada. I want it, you know, I want to go international now and to help other people internationally. Indigenous people, like, let's build an empire. Relationships that we cultivate are the richest things that we can do that can help us survive. Whanaunga tanga, manaki tanga, kaitiaki tanga. Those are all values that that indigenous people in Canada, Turtle Island have, that we have as Māori, so it's it's bigger than little old New Zealand, it's bigger than us. Um, she also talked about entrepreneurs, indigenous entrepreneurs when they go and that their base values are based on family, community and service, service not only to the people but service to the land, which is what we see here in New Zealand, which is a lot of Māori bringing up rungoa anti-plastic or no plastic stuff coming through. Mine directly was for Fano, our Fano that couldn't fit clothes that were 5, 6, 7 XL or had the clothes and couldn't fit them or could fit them but couldn't afford them. So that's where Style came into the picture. Uh, it's not about money, it's it's about the values that we hold. Um, Fano, land, communities. Oh, our sun's just gone down. Well, so I had to change my angle because my phone just died um, and I had to have it plugged into the charger now. So we're not looking at the pretty sunset anymore. However, so that was pretty much my Sunday um, and I caught it all with the beautiful Jace Maya. So again, um, and Mihiana Kiakwe Jace. If you are a 5, 6, or 7 XL, like, share, tag, comment, and join our event on the 4th of December. Um, Maybe